JB Kind doors supply pre-assembled pocket door systems that can be fitted in half the time of other brands. Easy to install and designed to be fitted within a stud wall with plasterboard, achieving a finished wall thickness of 125mm. Follow this step-by-step -step guide to see how we fitted a double pocket door system in our own door showroom. A double pocket door consists of two single systems that are joined together with a connector kit. Take time to read through the instructions and familiarise yourself with the component parts. Please note that there will be some spare metal jams and spaces that are only required if fitting a single system. These can be disregarded. There are a number of tools that will help you assemble the system, including a spirit level, mallet and drill. Please remember to wear gloves as some of the component parts can be sharp. Lay both cassettes flat with the double leaf conversion kit. Connect the top rail sections ensuring they are secure. U-shaped brackets are provided that can be clipped onto the rail and then fixed to the wooden stud head. Please note that they were not included for this instalment due to space limitation. If you would like the pocket doors to open and close simultaneously, a double simultaneous operator can be fitted, which is essentially a cable fitted to a pulley. If the system is not required, please omit this stage. Thread the cable through the pulleys until it meets back in the middle. To keep the cables connected, we found it easier to use a block to hold them temporarily in place. You are now ready to fix the header rail into the cassette system. Make sure that the cassette is square with the header rail and that all the tabs are located within the grooves. Repeat the same process for the second cassette. If you are fitting a single pocket door system, this is the point where you would fit the metal jam. Position the double spacer bars between the two cassettes. The ends of each bar are bent down 90 degrees. These spacers are provided to keep the structure square. The double pocket system is now ready to be positioned within the wall cavity. Make sure that everything is square and use packers if required. Screws are fixed through the stud work into the pocket cassette to secure it into place. When you are happy that the system is square and plumb, you can remove the spacer bars. Ensure that the header bar is absolutely square and screw it into place using packers if required. Alternatively, you can fix through the U-shaped brackets as mentioned previously. Generally, at this point, you would install the plasterboard using the self-tapping screws provided, fixing to the horizontal bars on the cassette face. As we're installing the pocket door system into our showroom, there wasn't a requirement to do this and complete decoration before fitting the doors. To prevent debris entering inside the pocket cavity, it is protected by a cover during installation. When you're ready to fit the doors, these plates can be removed. Door fitting accessories are stored inside. Each door has two wheel carriages that run inside the header. Fit the bolts into the carriages. These bolts will slot into two metal plates that are fixed at the top of each door. If you are fitting the double simultaneous operator, you will also need to fit the cable clamps to the opposite edges of each door. So that the doors do not bang when opened, fit the rubber bumpers onto the back edge of the doors. You are now ready to fit the floor guide. Please note that the bottom edge of the doors will need to be pre-grooved to 20mm by 6mm so that they can fit into the guide. Should you wish, our joinery workshop can pre-groove your doors prior to delivery. Your doors are now ready to be fitted. Lift the doors into position. It may help to place them on packers. Slide the bolts into the plates and adjust as required to make the doors level. When both doors are in place, final adjustment can be made. The cables for the double simultaneous operator can now be threaded through the clamps. It is important to ensure that both doors are completely central and line up perfectly. Thread onto the opposite side for the second door. Upon testing, you will see that the system has connected correctly and both doors open and close simultaneously. 
The spare cable can be trimmed off when you're happy that everything is working as it should. Timber accessory kits are available in either oak or white primed and should be fitted after all work is complete. The finishing touch that ensures your pocket doors look perfect. Pocket door systems not only save space but look incredibly stylish too. Visit jbkind.com for more information and for details on our UK network of suppliers.